Now to our Discover Black Heritage initiative, where we focus on the contributions of black Americans past and present here in Southern California. Hollywood isn't just in Hollywood. That's the thinking behind a new studio planned for South L.A. to tap into the creative talent that's already there, making movies and TV shows. NBC4's Ted Chen shows us the vision behind it and the potential economic impact. Who's stressed? Not you. Who the best? It's you. The groundbreaking show Insecure made South Los Angeles a cool place to do TV. And through Insecure and the wonderful work that was done on that particular series, it's created a real movement. South LA's own Stan Washington is leading a team of developers to continue that momentum. The project is called the Stalker Street Creative, a vision to build 60,000 square feet of sound stages right across the street from the Baldwin Hills Crenshaw Plaza, a TV and movie making centerpiece to show that Hollywood stretches much further south than you might think. This is the home of Issa Rae and Tiffany Haddish. And most people are unaware that uh, the areas of Baldwin Hills, View Park, and Ladera Heights is the most affluent African-American community in the country. The goal of this project is to tap into all of the Hollywood talent in this area, entertainment workers behind and in front of the camera who live in Baldwin Hills and Crenshaw and View Park and Windsor Hills and Lemur Park so that they don't have to go elsewhere to do their jobs. Not having to drive over the hill or um, you know, way over into um, other parts of the city. This project is being led from start to finish by individuals of color. That does not typically happen uh, when you talk about doing major development, particularly in Los Angeles. Groundbreaking for the two-year, $100 million privately financed project is planned for the end of this year. In South LA, Ted Chen, NBC4 News.